hello, hello guys! Welcome back to my channel! So, mag english ang catch! For today's video, I'm gonna talk about the four-legged animals, the mammals, with their scientific name and uses. So, may pinili akong 21 na animals, which I can share and hope may matutunan ka. Kaya, if you are interested to this video, keep watching until the end. Karabaw! Ako ang mauna dahil ako ang pambansang kalabaw ng Pilipinas. Meron tayong dalawang uri ng karabaw, which is the swamp buffaloes at river type buffaloes. Pero uunahin natin tong swamp buffaloes na karaniwang nakikita natin dito sa Pilipinas. Ang scientific name nito is Bubalus bubalis. They are the Philippine karabaw and thigh buffalo raised primarily for draft and meat production. Ito ang river type buffaloes. Ang scientific name nila ay Bubalus bubalis carabanensis. Kita nyo naman na mas malaki at mas maitim ang mga kalabaw na ito kaysa yung Philippine karabaw natin. They are for dairy type kasi mas marami itong naiproproduce na milk kaysa yung swamp buffaloes. They are the Indian and Pakistani breeds. Cattle. Meron tayong dalawang uri. Ito ang temperate at tropical cattle. At syempre, mauna tayo sa temperate cattle. Ang scientific name nito is Bose Taurus. They are without hump or wala silang bukol sa likod. They are subjected to strong selection for dairy, beef, or dual purpose characteristics. Kinagamit rin silang pang crossbreed sa mga tropical countries. At ito ang sang litrato ng tropical cattle or the hump cattle kasi meron silang bukol sa likod. Ang scientific name nila is Bose Enricus. They are originated from Indian Cebu or Brahman. Bose Enricus has a larger ears and a shorter coats. Horse. Ang scientific name nila ay Ecus caballus. They are used for riding and transport, carrying things or pulling carts. Tinutulungan rin nila ang mga farmers sa pagbungkal ng lupa. People use selective breeding na pwedeng makagawa ng mas mabigat na gawain. And also, some people use horses as pet. Yak. Meron tayong dalawang uri ng yak. Ito ang domestic yak at wild yak. Pero unahin natin tong domestic yak. Ang scientific name nila ay Bose Grunians. They are bred for tractability and high milk production. Yak are also used for plowing and threshing as well as for meat, hides, and fur. The dried dung of the yak is the only obtainable fuel on the treeless Tibetan Plateau. At ito ay isang wild yak. Ang scientific name nila ay Bos Mutus. Mas malaki sila kaysa yung domestic yak. Mule Anak ito ng male donkey at female horse. Ang scientific name nila ay Ecus mulus. They are draft and pack animals. They help do fields, haul loads, and do other important tasks. Donkey Ang scientific name nila ay Ecus asinus. They provided a means of transportation for agricultural goods and human themselves. Donkey's milk has high quality addition to a healthy diet. 
bison, also called buffalo or wisem. They are the Ice Age survivors. Meron tayong dalawang uri nito, which is the plain bison and wood bison. Pero unahin natin ang plain bison. Ang scientific name nila ay Bos bison bison. Bison provides meat for food, hides for clothing, shelter, and horns and bones for tools. They live in river valleys and on plains. Ito naman ang wood bison. Ang scientific name nito is Bos bison anthabasi. Mas malaki ang bukol nila sa likod kesa yung plain bison. Their habitat are also in grassland and siege meadows occurring on alkaline soil. Elk, also known as wapiti. Ang scientific name nila ay Cervus canadensis. They are one of the largest species of deer in the world. Their velvet antlers are processed into folk medicines. Boos. Ang scientific name nila is Alces alces. They are a member of the New World Deer subfamily and is the largest and heaviest extant species in the deer family. Moose are valued for their meat and as a game animal. Moose and elk has a difference in terms of their weight and antlers. Moose are huge than the elk. Bull moose shed their antlers each year. Moose are powerful swimmers. Oxen. Ang scientific name nila ay Bos taurus or Bos taurus primigenius. Oxen are used on farms to do work such as plow fields, pull stone boats, and many more. Oxen are commonly used to skid logs in forest. Sheep. Ang scientific name nila ay Ovis aris. They are meek animals. They are raised for fleeces, meat, and milk purposes. Goat. Ang scientific name nila ay Capra hircus. They are the producers of meat, milk, fiber, and other products. However, goats are raised or kept for wider range uses such as brush control, livestock shows, packing, and lively companions. Deer Ang scientific name nila ay Odopolius virginianus. They produce meat, velvet, antler, and leather. Other body parts are used in Eastern medicine. They are the only group of animals in the world to have antlers. Llama. Ang scientific name nila is Lama Glama. They are raised as companion animals. Nagagamit rin ang kanilang wool for products at ang kanilang dung as fertilizer. They are livestock guardian protecting sheep, goats, and other animals from predators. Alpaca. Ang scientific name nila ay Vicugna Pacos. Alpaca fiber is used for making knitted and woven items like blankets, sweater, hats, gloves, and other items. Camel. Their scientific name is Camelus bactrianus. They travel fast as horse. Camels are used for wool, milk, meat, leather, and even dung, which can be used for fuel. They are working animals especially suited to their desert habitat. Gayal, also called Mithan. Ang scientific name nito is Bos gaurus frontalis. This is mainly used as sacrificial animal during religious festival 
in exchange of high price. This was according to Jasundin and Islam 203b. Swine Meron tayong dalawang uri ng swine which is the domesticated swine and the wild boar. Pero unahin natin tong domesticated swine na ang scientific name ay Sus Scrofa. They are used as food consumption. Bacon, pork chops, and ham are all swine products. Wild boar. Ang scientific nila is Sus Vitatus. They are also known as wild pig. Wild boars threaten native ecosystem diversity through the opportunistic predation of amphibians, reptiles, rodents, and other small mammals and disruption of nests or hatching because wild boar are aggressive. Guinea pig Ang scientific name nila is Cavia porcellus. It is also known as the cavi or the domesticated cavi. It is a species of rodents belonging to the genus Cavia in the family Cavidae. Guinea pig also widely used to provide tissues and organs for researches. Guinea pig blood components are widely used in isolated organs preparations such as guinea pig lung and intestine used in research to develop new medicines. Rabbit Their scientific name is Oryctolagus coniculus. They are also known as bunnies or bunny rabbit. Rabbits are used for their wool, fur, and pelts as well as their nitrogen-rich manure, which is to be a fertilizer, and their high-protein milk. Rabbits are important as food because of their ability to utilize foodstuff that humans are unable to use. Dog Ang scientific name nila is Canis lupus. The dog or the domesticated dog is a domesticated canid. The dog is a derived from an ancient extinct wolf and the modern gray wolf is the dog's nearest living relative. The dog was the first species to be domesticated by hunters and gatherers. Dogs are mainly used for social purposes and companionship. They are bred for such as herding, hunting, and retrieving. Dogs can also reduce stress, anxiety, and depression. <laughs>